Hey guys, welcome back to PvP Battles, and today is the fifth in the series, and we are two for two at the minute. I honestly got owned the last game, there was no doubt about me getting absolutely hammered, and I learned from it. I learned that most people are now using Dragonoids, Elemental types, and Undead types, because the last two battles, the same kind of setup was similar. The pets that they were using were different apart from the Phoenix Hatchling. Which seems to be quite OP, but you know, I haven't got him leveled up yet. But I will, I will sit down today, tomorrow maybe, even though it is New Year's night, and I'm gonna have a good old drink and whatnot. So it'll probably not be today, probably not be tomorrow, but maybe the next day I will sit down and level that cunt up so I can try him out. Because I really want to. So today's team, we are using the Emerald Shade Hatchling. Or whatever you want to call it. And he is using his Stone Ratchet stack, which I'm kind of worried about using this because it does so much damage to me. So it might only be used in case of emergencies. We are also using the Leech Life attack, which does damage plus it also heals and does a double heal if he has a sticky web on him. So that is why we have our sticky web, plus that also keeps the guy from fleeing for two turns which is always good as long as he's not whipping my ass in the first place so that is number one guy then next we have the crimson hat er, whelpling and he is using his deep breath attack which does 800 damage in two turns which is pretty sweet so as long as their team doesn't have a dodge ability or something like that we should be grand and should hit even though this does have quite a high chance of missing but it's all good we also have our healing er his healing flame attack which heals for 300 plus half of whatever the user has just used so say he used a, or he just used a really strong attack i can get half of that back by using this ability which is pretty damn sweet and we're also going with the standard breath attack which is pretty decent too and we also have the internal strider and this guy is using his pump ability which does two or it takes two turns to actually use the first turn it gives you a damage increase by 10%, which is pretty sweet. So you could just have this popped on and maybe bluff your opponent into using one of his dodge abilities or something. And then the second attack, when you use it again, does 600 damage, which is pretty damn sweet. And we're also using the Cleansing Rain attack, which buffs up water abilities, which I have two water abilities on this guy, and also heals the team for 100 HP, which is pretty nice. It is pretty nice. All my pets... For this game have healing abilities and we're also going with the water jet ability which does a bog standard 300. I was quite tempted to use the poison spit but they have actually took the kind of bug out that that had where it would still attack people that were burrowed and when they were on fly and stuff. So we'll get into our pet battle and hopefully it doesn't take us too long to get one. I will bounce about while waiting. <clears throat> okay here we go here is our pet battle so let's see what will happen this time oh dear i'm frightened i don't i don't want to go negative on this i don't want to be losing more than i'm winning i really don't so i need to win this one and i will try my damnedest to win this one today so mac if you want to hurry up and load we would like to get into the game here radio we are up against another Dragonoid, we are up against an Elemental type, and we are also up against a Mechanical. Oh dear, oh dear. So right, what we're going to do is Crimson Welpin to start off with. And, um, can any, oh, there, there we go. I was about to say there. Wait, what? I didn't pick him. Why did I, you stupid fucking thing. Didn't pick the damn pet, and yet, he goes, <coughs> So right, you're using that, right? Do you know what? Fuck this. I am going to use a Stone Rush attack. Just for the LOLs. Alright, Call Storm shouldn't do too much. But I'm an elemental type, so this isn't going to do any damage to me anyway. So, nyeh, 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 nyeh. Such a big child. Right, there we go. Some health back. And we are going to web this guy back up. And will you stop attacking the fucking thing that you're strong against, you dick? Uh, you gotta hit that, don't you? You just gotta hit that. So right. Do you know what we're going to do? We're actually going to finish him, because I can finish him off with a Stone Rush attack. And, oh, what? You 
slimy little rat getting a critical hit off. You got that that's annoyed me so it has, but you know what? Screw it. Alright, who are you gonna bring out here, bro? Who are you gonna bring out? That is not a nice thing to bring out, but you know what we're gonna do? We are gonna switch out and we are gonna bring out the Eternal Strider and we are gonna get ourselves a heal on. And oh that is annoying. Right, heal up. Alright, what has he got? Sons of Roots. That is not going to be fun, and a tidal wave attack, and also at least he can continue to use that, which wouldn't be good. Right, I'm going to use the pump ability, which pumps my strength up, and next I'm just going to use my water jet, and next turn, once he pops himself back up, we're going to get a pump off and knock him out. Alright, this battle is so slow. Oh, you jamball. Right, we will Cleansing Rain up again. I'm guessing he's going to build himself a little turret or two. Yep, there's one turret down, and it's quite a strong ability, but you know what? We are going to f hopefully finish him off. I do... No, no, no! Motherfucker. Right, do you know what? Please go first here. No, he's not even going to, so he's going to finish him off as well, so he is. <sighs> what is the deal with this guy critting so much? Right, I'm going to have to just burn him down. I'm not liking this one. I'm going to lose this one again. I'm going to lose it again. I have just dodged, missed, and he's crit like a fucking cunt. So, there's not much I can do about this one. Not much at all. Right, finish him off here. You better hit. Thank you. Doesn't make a difference because he's going to come back to life anyway. And he's going to finish me off. He didn't finish me off. Right, so I will die anyway. There we go. I got fucking owned. Because a fucking misses and him critting. That is a fucking ridiculous sort of. That is absolutely a joke. But there you go. I have just lost. It is now 2 and 3. That is not good, but what the fuck can you do about that? His team was clearly better than mine, and he got all the luck of the draw by critting, and I was missing. So, there you go. I've been Bullo, and I will see you all later.